And I'd like to see some of that pride come back somehow, you know, from all the past, you know, from all the past things that have happened in our community. My father, for instance, he was a trapperman and a fisherman. But when the dam came, it destroyed a lot of things. My father couldn't do the, make a living out of that anymore because it's destroyed, you know, the power, the dam destroyed a lot of our environment. Yeah, I'd sell my fish, they're always fresh, and, but sometimes when the water comes up, uh, the fish are gone. They're not around where I fish. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, when, but when the water goes down, that's when the fish all come back. They eat the minnows, yeah. And then, did you fish with a uh, rod and reel or net? No, I'm a commercial fisherman. Okay. Yeah. And so do you still do that? Yeah, I still do that, but I couldn't do that this year, this spring, because of the the waterways. The fluctuated went so high this this year. And uh, I was going to say, I lost all my nets. My uh, skidoo is underwater, really? and my boat is underwater, my motor, and uh, my two canoes, I don't know where they are. This June 1st, because we start on June 1st, and I couldn't fish this year because of that. The water is so high, and I lost all my stuff. The water is going up and down, up and down. There should be a really big, nice, beautiful sandy beach, and now it's just all filled with, you know, like um, rocks and debris and all that, like dead wood. And, and uh, th there's, no more, there's no more beach there. We have lost a green frog, a leopard frog, I believe they call it. Oh, yes. That's been missing for years. Um, a skunk has gone uh, right out of this country. Like, there's no skunk around here. Really? It used to be, the dogs used to go out in the bush, they'd come out smelling. Yes. Now, uh, for the last, 20, 25 years, there's none. Mm. Um, the uh, other species that's missing is the porcupine. There's no porcupine at all. And there used to be porcupine. There used to be lawns. Yeah. There's a rock there, they call it sturgeon head. It looks like a sturgeon head, mm -hmm. but it's a big rock. Mm -hmm. And the natives used to stand there waiting for the sturgeons to come through and spear them from there. Mm -hmm. But the water's been so low, none of that, you don't see any of that anymore. So is that a change from because of Island Falls? Yes, because of the dam. So the water's lower Yeah, down. sometimes it go up, sometimes it'll go down, you know. So that's, today, I don't like fishing up river, because all you get is sticks. Mm. I always tell my nephew, no, I don't want to go fishing. I might catch uh, somebody's cabin. <laughs> yeah, we need to build our own, our own buildings. We're going to employ our people, make money, make them, you know, get the cash flow going, whatever you want to call it. You know, we can send our people out education, ed educate them, bring them back and okay. educate each other. What, I, what needs to be in nurses, teachers. Discrimination. It's based on discrimination, based on our religion. And a lot of things that go along with discrimination. That's what's happening here. And they've done it, they've done it in the past, present, and probably into the future too. Yeah, but it's still here. I've expressed that in Regina back in August the 4th when we had a meeting with Sash Power. There's too much discrimination based on the race, race. So and, it's, and it's still happening. <laughs>